It certainly is not the only festive event that we are covering for you all day. Robert Lowry has new video and reaction from another 4th of July favorite, this one in Centerville. Robert? Some light rain was not enough to keep thousands of people home in Centerville this morning. What started as a small street sale has grown into something much larger. Behind it, a community unwilling to let anything stop in their way, in their way of celebrating Independence Day. A wet morning couldn't stop the march of Franklin Street. Seats left for days on the sidewalks are filled with eager faces waiting to see the line of lights and sounds coming toward them. A show of strong support this Independence Day where people could have traded a morning in the rain for a chance to catch up on some much needed sleep. You know, I think because it's so much fun, you know, we don't charge anybody anything to get in and it's a very fun event. In its 40th year, the Centerville Washington Township Americana Festival has gone through many changes. What started as a small street sale has turned into a $150,000 investment. That doesn't include what, you know, the city and township donate. You know, I imagine with all the police and firemen, it would cost us an immense amount of money to pay for that, which we don't have to. So. Then there's more than 100 volunteers working behind the scenes to get the festival up and running. The event in Centerville has become more than the celebration for America's independence. Wenstrup says it shows just how much the community has come together to support the annual tradition, even braving the elements to watch months of hard work stroll by. This year, uh, we did have some, some cutbacks that we had to make, but you know, in the end, the business is really came forward and, and we may come close to breaking even, which would be great. Even after 40 years, the Americana Festival continues to march on. A little bit of rain is a minor inconvenience to stop an Independence Day celebration in Centerville. Organizers said they will begin preparing for next year as early as this fall. They don't plan on making the festival bigger as much as they would like to see it get better. Fireworks are still slated to go off tonight from the Centerville High School football stadium at 10 if the weather holds out. Robert Lowry, 2 News, working for you.